According to the Secretary of Defense, all military personnel returning from West Africa will undergo a 21-day controlled monitoring program. 90 U.S. service members arrive at Langley Transit Center to begin this process where they will be separated from the general public. We're the eyes and ears on the ground, so um, yes, the personnel are here to be monitored and get their temperature check checked twice a day, but we're also here to make sure that they have what they need um, to, to live comfortably out here. Although the transit center has many accommodations to make the service members feel at home, camp leadership's main focus is the safety and security of camp personnel. Um, what we've done is for personnel coming in um, to the site, they'll be identified by um, a vest. We've also told people that are coming in to fix HVAC or things like that not to come to the area to notify their leadership that they can't come in the area if they're sick. What we don't want to do is get people inside of the Langley Transit Center sick. No additional service members will be monitored at Langley Transit Center until current personnel complete the 21-day period and return to their home stations. The Transit Center will stay open for returning personnel for as long as necessary. Senior Airman Jordan Garner, Langley Air Force Base, Virginia.